Hello everyone, this is Global Fashion Workshop. I remind you that we post new videos every day. I also want to remind you that some of my video courses are also available. Buy them if you haven't done it yet. I would really appreciate your support. Today I'd like to talk to you about the diversity in clothing. We usually associate the word different with a great number of garments. We think that the more clothes we have, the more different we look. I believe that this is not entirely true. I'd like to share my ideas with you. Even though the autumn is on, I want to talk to you about light clothes. I know that it's hot through the whole year in some parts of the world. And we all go on vacation. Summer is a nice period. The nature is bright, the sun is shining, flowers are blooming. And our image should correspond to the beauty of the nature. You can hardly have a good mood wearing your old worn-out dress. And you need to be in a good mood every day. A new dress can help you. If you have a lot of different garments in your wardrobes, you may get tired of them. You would want something new very soon. It's better to have a few items at the beginning of the season and get something new by the end of it. When I think about difference, I realize how many advantages sewing women have. First of all, we create our good mood ourselves. We can sew a new garment easily. Our minds are full of new ideas, new designs and unusual decorations. We don't worry about routine. We care more about our image. I'm so happy that I can make clothes myself. I can make a new garment any day. It takes me just 20 minutes to cut it and not so much time to sew it. If we talk about combining clothes, you might hear about capsule wardrobe from fashion bloggers. I think it's dull. I have a different point of view. I'd like to share with you my ideas on how to be different. If you like maxi and minty dresses, you should alternate making them. One color and pretty garment should change one another. Be creative. For example, you can combine your sundress with a t-shirt. Thus, you can get a new look and your sundress gets a new function. Of course, you should have different trousers, skirts, blouses, shirts as well. Select colors for your clothes in such way that you can combine them with each other and mix sets. In this case, you'll be able to have a new look almost every day. The human brain is arranged in such way that we don't remember what a person put on a day before. You can wear a new garment once and then put it on again in several days. People around you won't even probably remember it. It's better to make garments of different styles. If you have a strict cotton skirt, sew a flared skirt decorated with lace. Make a blouse that you can combine with both skirts, as well as with trousers. Thus, you can combine these four times in different ways and create new looks. Sew a top, which you can combine with skirts and trousers. You make only one garment and get several different looks. I should say that cotton and linen garments wear out quickly. By the moment you've made several different garments, some of them need to be replaced. You can make a new dress having bought 150 cm of linen. You would not spend too much money and you would get a new garment. Accessories are also very helpful for creating different looks. They are not expensive. It's better to avoid golden jewelry and precious stones in summer. Choose accessories which are suitable for light clothes. 
buy beads that you can combine with a dress or a blouse. Having small number of garments, you can create a lot of different looks. Thus, you create a good mood for yourself and for people around you. It's always good when a woman is happy and pleased with her hairstyle, her new dress or blouse. I also want to note that it's easier to make a summer wardrobe than the one for winter. Fabric for sewing warm clothes is usually more expensive. You need to buy a lot of wool for sewing outerwear. Cotton, linen, cambric are simple and cheap. There is one more important thing I want to tell you. Do not line all of your summer dresses. Otherwise, you would need to wash and iron them every day. It's better to make a dark and a light underdresses and combine them with your dresses. It's easier to wash an underdress than the dress itself. I also don't recommend choosing garments of complicated designs for summer. A simple linen dress with pockets, decorated with lace or colored threads would look fresh and unusual. Complicated designs do not always look good. Have a look at the dress I'm wearing now. I've already shown it to you. The bodice was made according to the 10 measurement cutting system. There is a button stand, a waist seam and pockets on the front. It's very comfortable and stylish. And it's of a pretty simple design. When a season comes, have a look at your wardrobe. Decide what you need to sew. Make a new blouse and combine it with trousers and skirts. Do not be afraid of colored garments. There should be different colors in your wardrobes. Black and white wardrobes look dull. Break the rules. Make unexpected choices. Choose different color combinations. Read fashion magazines to get new ideas. Even if you don't like reading articles in them, look through the pictures. I'm glad that I have a chance to share my thoughts with you. I really hope that you find my videos useful. Me and my team work really hard to post new videos every day. We show you a lot of useful details and techniques. We tell you different peculiarities of working with different fabrics, different details, different garments. We give you a lot of information for free. But we also have paid courses, some of which are already available. We are working on many more courses. Buy the ones which are already available if you haven't done it yet. I would really appreciate your support. In the courses, we show you the sewing of the garments from the beginning to the very end. All the techniques, all the details. There is nothing we do off the camera. We show you everything. My courses are very detailed. We work really hard on them. I really hope that after watching this video, you would realize that you don't need to spend too much money or to sew too many garments to look different every day. Don't be lazy. Sew a new garment once in a week or two or at least a month. Make clothes for yourselves, your daughters, your granddaughters, your friends. Each time a woman sews a new garment, the world gets a bit better. That's all for today. Let's be different and beautiful together. My name is Irina Baukste. 
buy my courses, subscribe to my channel, write comments, share the videos, press the like and the bell buttons. I would really appreciate your support. Thank you. Goodbye.